Video-based learning is hot. Every day, more and more videos are being watched on YouTube, Vimeo and other channels. People like videos. But do they actually learn from videos? Not all videos are for educational purposes. Let's look at an example. If you want to learn a French word for poster, une affiche, a video might not be the best way. I just told you and you probably already forgot it. If we also show you, it becomes easier to understand it. But even if we tell you and train you how to pronounce it, like a fish, it will help you understand and you probably remember it tomorrow. Une affiche. Videos work very well for demonstrations, introductions and examples. And in the language example, not per se about content, about pure knowledge elements, but it will work if you want to teach someone about pronunciation. How you shoot your video is an interesting point. If you want to watch a talking head, like I'm right now, then if you watch it more than five minutes, it's probably going to bore you. So when you're actually going to select and use educational video, you have to think about the following things. Let's start with the learning objective. What are you about to train? And how does the video fit into that? Is it to engage them? Is it showing an example? Is it seeing and doing? Think about that when you're searching or buying or making your video. If you search a video on the internet, be aware that the source is credible. Otherwise, the author can change, modify or even delete the video and you're not able to use it. Once you have selected your video, I recommend that you test it in your training and evaluate it. Good luck! <laughs>